What's up, party people? Little fashionistas back on the track. Super Red Ted Redemption Bros. About to bros. rip it up. Get some new duds. Hey, Ted. What's up? Hi, Ted. What's up? Guys, Ted's in the room. Everyone welcome Ted. Guys, we tried to get rid of Ted by uh, having him go get Gerard a cup of tea, and he brought it back, and it smells great. He came back. Oh, don't put it on me, Ted. Ted! Don't you dare. If you burn this beard, I will end you. <laughs> Just give it a little sniff. It smells- it smells delicious, Ted. Thank you. Thank you, Ted. You're welcome, Gerard. No one's gonna hear that, Ted. Sorry. If you want to talk at the <laughs> mic, you have to get close, Ted. Come on. Ted's whole hey, demeanor changes Gerard's when we're- really great, everyone. <laughs> what was that, Ted? Gerard's really great, everyone. He's a team player, this guy. Ted's whole demeanor changes when- when the record button is on. He it's comes really in great. here and he just turns into Mr. Bean, practically. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> It's true. Um, alright. So, what we have to do is, A, we need to go buy something from the dude in Thieves Landing, but we also need to defend the town from the- from the boys. Yeah, and we can't- we have to wait for them, though. That's the issue. What's the actual verbiage on it? We- they have to, like, invade and we yeah, have to Yeah, but what's the them. actual verbiage? Alright, alright. Cause I'm gonna, like, try and look it up and see if there's a way we it can, like, says. crock it. Defend residents of Hennigan's Steed from the Baller Twins gang. Okay. Let's go. It's like, I think it's a situation where we just have to be at the right place at the right time. What? That's such a shitty mission. Yeah, dude. We were there. I didn't even realize they were attacking. I didn't want to risk it for because, the biscuit. No, you're right, because one time a dude just ran into a firefight and got shot and it was just like an innocent man. I murdered him. Yeah. I had no idea. That's on me. And I'm not ready to do that again. Unless any random money. event, any random event in that area where you save someone from outlaws. Stagecoast robberies, saving some guy's fiance from being lynched, returning a stolen horse. All these count. What the hell? What's going on here? I don't know. Yo, you were... All right, you know what? Fuck you. You know what, though? We just... Like right before we started, he we, like we went saved, and a, saved horse. a horse, and it didn't count. Yeah. So what do we? So we're just gonna ride around in this purple circle until we see some outlaw activity and try and like take the dude out. Possibly, or we can just move on to another mission and come back at a different time. We can. I feel like we're just so close to this outfit. Look, I'm right there with you. I agree. Stagecoach. I just. What is that? Oh, that's the night mission. Don't do that. Yeah, I'm not being a night boy. Maybe go over to those people, maybe like, they'll like, spawn a bad guy near him. Like, take a hard right. Like, go like, all the way around that building to the right even more, yeah, like, go over there. See those people? This one seems pretty civil so far. Yeah. This is the, uh... This is the tame, tame west. It's uncharacteristic, you know? It's supposed to be the wild, wild west, you know what I mean? Desperado. Rough Rider. You are killing it. No, you don't want nada. All right, None of you got six okay. Gun this. You don't brother no, running this. No, Buffalo. You, don't, you don't need to go anymore. You I just ran I, over a man. Sometimes you have to run over a man. What do you mean? Sometimes you got to run over a man. Sometimes you have to just run over him. All right. Do you agree? I I don't know if I agree. You agree? It seems like you agree. I don't think it I agree. Seems I, like you agree. I don't think it's necessary to run a man over at some point. Sometimes you have to. Where's a villain. All right. Well, what do you want to do? You want to go? Just go over to. Uh, uh, what's that guy's name? Seth. Yeah. Seth. We can do a Seth mission. Or uh, the Wizard of Oz. Or the Wizard of Oz. William Carlos Williams. What's his name? I have no idea. Randall Fisk. Nigel West Dickens. Yes. William Carlos Williams. Who's that? Who the fuck is that? Question of the day, why do I know who William Carlos Williams is? Sounds like he just made it up. No. No. Who the fuck is that? Is he a poet? He's a poet? Thank you, Kristen. Alright. He's a poet, the you guys. fuck? Oh, yeah, here we go. Dude, it- is- is it just me? Like, actual question of the day, is it just me, or does it bum you out, too, when it's raining in a video game? No, I like it when it rains. Like this? Yeah. Means that new creatures and people will show up that weren't there before. Like worms? Yeah. Wait, what? What do you mean? 
You know, like what when it rains worms? and like the worms are all like, ew, we're weird. No, I don't mean that. Man, what if there be? Oh, I thought, is this? No, no he's just a dude. I was about ready to shoot him in the I back was, of yeah, the head. <laughs> just murder a man on the road every time you see one who's Look. riding. Don't ride too fast on your horse. We're gonna cowboy hat profile you. If you're wearing a cowboy hat, you're going down. You better take those off. Yeah, there's no one here. All's quiet here in the McFarland Ranch. All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's go do a mission. All right. But if we see a motherfucker, I'm gonna kill him. Yeah. If we see a motherfucker, we're in Purple Town. They's going down. You are going in the dead opposite direction. You are correct, good sir. All right. Let's fucking do it. Oh, what if this was it? We're just kind of trotting along, and suddenly these assholes show up. Because here's the thing: I really want that fucking outfit. We've come so far. We played so many fucking games of shitty ass horseshoes. We did pretty well considering. Yo, fuck Rufus. Guys, a cheater. Got, we, we took Rufus out. We definitely took him down. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is. All right. That was a good time. You know what I mean? We took him out. Yeah, Ja feel. Absolute. We move in. We move in. We move in. We move in. <gasps> Wait. There. Oh my God. That's dudes. Kill him. Shit. Oh no, not the horse. They killed him. Doesn't they matter. fucking Doesn't killed matter. the dude! Doesn't matter though? You fucking did it. Did I just do it? Christmas is real. Fuck it. Yes! Fuck it! Yes! Alright! Yes. Dude, I don't even care that that guy died. I don't he's, even- I don't even feel bad. No! Oh. Don't. He's dead. He's murdered a man in cold blood. Sometimes you have to do it. In the street, why? Sometimes- what is that? Eyewitness? That uh -oh. guy saw you. What You're do gonna I have do? to- you have to go kill him. Really? I mean, either that or- No, you know what? Please don't kill him. Oh, yeah, you'll become wanted if they tell law enforcement. Oh, my God. Yeah, they're dead now. Wow. Lost a lot of honor that on that one. That dark as fuck. That was like an episode of Breaking Bad all of a sudden. Yeah, but you know what? Guess what? We Holy did shit. it. All right, let's go do this real quick, then. Have we ever been to this town? Once. Oh, okay. Went to it once. All right, well, let's go over there. We can buy that house at any rate, and then we can go buy the fucking outfit from the tailor. Yeah, dude. Wow. Wait, are we in danger? Now that you were one for crimes, you can't help strangers. Yo, that's the eyewitness. They just keep bringing new ones. What the fuck? I keep losing. I just lost 150 honor. Ugh. And there's another one right there. No, he didn't see us. He didn't have an eyeball. We're good. All right, I'll stop killing everyone. <laughs> Yo, low key. Super yeah. Gla super glad about that. That's my burger. That's beautiful. Thank you, Patrick. Patrick brought me a burger, you guys. It's tight. It's tight that he did that. It's from Johnny Rockets, dude. It's, it's no joke. Question of the day, part three. What's your favorite burger? Come on, come on. I'm not talking about, like, double western bullshit guacamole fucking <laughs> steak sauce <laughs> fucking horse shit. I'm talking about a real cheeseburger or hamburger if you're, like, a lactose intolerant human being. I want to know who makes the best hamburger. And it can't be some shit like, oh, this one restaurant in my hometown where an old lady's been making for 40 years. I'm talking about, like, something we Yo. all know about. Oh, shit. The smallest I'll go is regional chain. Regional chain's the smallest I'll go. What is that? I don't know. Oh, is it like, give me water, sir? Talk to the man. What you searching for, partner? I've been gathering some flowers for my wife. She's waiting for me back in the cabin. That's very sweet. This is another oh, one where, like, dead. she's dead. Fifty years now, me and my darling Annabelle. She's always thought of these, these wild. There's no way this woman is not dead. Yeah, you you killed her, dude. Sorry. There's no way. You're not doing too good. Hard for her to get up and about. Hard for her to get up and about. Do you think she's like? Cow, or a horse, or something weird like that. Yeah. How old can horses get? I feel like fifty is like too old for a horse, right? 
A horse can't be 50. Google it. A horse is like wearing like a like a sweater vest. And he's like slowing down and what? You know, he sits in his living room all day just a watching horse? his stories. I mean, I, at age what 50. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking about? Hey Siri. How old can horses get? Okay. One option I see is Palos Verdes stables and Via Opare. Fucking what the fuck, Siri? Like what? Siri why do will I never tell it? you why absolute do I even answer. Have it? She literally just is like, I went Max to Google for you. Age on horses. Max age on horses. You guys remember when Siri used to actually tell you things? Now she just gives you fucking Google links and calls it a day. She's like, I don't know what you're talking about, but I do know the word horse. Uh, the oldest horse that ever lived was Old Billy. He was born in Lancashire in 1760 and lived to the record age for horses of 62 years. Dang. The average lifespan of a horse is only 20, and that's actually quite old. 20 horse years would be like a human living to 100. Oh, wow. So you're telling me that Old Billy lived to 300? We're talking there was a 300-year-old horse? That's fucking crazy. Kill the thief. I'm jump, stuck. Jump. What? Oh shit, hurry. I'm working on it. <laughs> Can't this jump. Is like, this is like the guy who like didn't get on the freeway and tried to take side streets and there was like nine stop signs in his way. Oh, is he shit. gone? He might be. He's gone, dude. What the fuck? Come on, horse. War horse. Come on, horse. The war horse. Come on, horse. War horse. I'm catching up! The war horse is fucking up, dude. What is going on? Let's go! Oh, dude, you're catching up! Just keep moving! Oh my god. Come on, you piece oh of shit. Alright, here we are. Alright, here he goes. Where are ya? He's wrecked. Where are ya? He's there. He's done. Oh yeah? He's done. Oh my god, he's gonna get shredded. Off of the shredded this poor man. That's too many bullets. He's already on the ground dead. You shot him. You shot his hands off. You shot both of that man's hands off. You need to be taught a lesson. What is the lesson? You only get one life, YOLO. He got taught that lesson? Yeah. What the f- Alright. 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 Go back to the shopkeeper and see if this guy has the Bollard Twins outfit for us to wear. Because I am dying to put it on, number one. And number two, save it because I want it to be sh sh like shiny and bright outside. You're not digging this depressing zone right now? I just don't think of like pouring rain and sadness. Elegant suit entry. Wait, what? Elegant suit menu entry added? Did I just. Oh, I just did another suit thing. What? You did like another. What did you do? I don't know. You got your money back. Mighty good of you. Who said that? I don't know. Here you are. Oh, we did. There's no way that was John Marston. Yeah, it was. That didn't sound like him at all. We just couldn't hear it. It was like, here you are. I got your money back. Can you, can you, uh, go into the, uh... Is there, like, a tailor? I'm not exactly sure. I'll look at the map real quick. Wait. The purple's gone. What? Did we, like, glitch the game out? What's going on here? Purchase the tailor. The... Uh huh. Which one's the tailor? The one with the scissors. Oh, I thought that was a barber. Dude, so close you can almost taste it. Release your inhibitions. Feel the suit on your skin. What? That's that's where you're at right now. That's what, what you're feeling. I'm excited. To put just, on the suit. Just singing that song. That's, I'm just excited to put on the suit. I'm just psyched that there's a suit to put on. And that makes me think of, uh... God damn it, it what's pink? her name? No. Not pink. No, what the fuck is her name? Yo, don't get mad at me because I don't know that song. I, I keep wanting to say that it's Demi Lovato, but that's not true. It's, it's, what's her name? Natasha Leggero? Natasha... Lombardi. Natasha Bedingfield. Oh my god, that's right. You know what that reminds me of? My what? little sister. That's like some shit that she would put on in her room like 400 times. Okay, here's the deal. I'm in the tailor's home. You just broke into there his house. There is no tailor to buy from. 
What? Taylor is closed for the holiday. My question is, is it like 1.30 in the morning right now? Yeah, probably. You're in the physician. The, the, the Taylor's on the Fine first- Fine linens. Yeah, but it's not here on the map. All I'm right, go, go buy that house and sleep I'll, in it. I already bought the house, okay, let's, so I'll okay, go sleep. Okay, yeah, just go sleep in the house you just bought. Sure. Question of the day, is there anybody out You've there- You've asked so many questions Question of the today. day number four. To... Question of the day number four. <laughs> is there anybody out there who has purchased a home? That they haven't slept in. Like, you mean like in real life? They bought like, a home? I want to know if there's a listener of our show who like owns a house that they have not slept in. I want to know the situation. I want to know what it's all about. I want to know why that happened, how that happened. Are you like super rich and you just like buy property in other countries and cities because you're like a baller? Also, if you are, please send your money to Alex. Guys, if you're Fossiani. rich, if you if you guys are out there and you're rich and you love the Beard Bros, Fossiani at gmail.com. Send me $2,000 on my PayPal. Why not? <laughs> Do you have any idea Just, how poor I am, you crazy people? Why aren't you doing that already? Let's go. You crazy people. You have a weird way of asking for help. If I was what in is this? What ancient is this? Rome... Oh, dude, hey. he's going to rape her. Get him. Hell yeah. That's how it should be done. Got you, girl. What's up? That's what I'm talking about. Because we're killers and nobody likes us. What if, what if when you did that to like dead bodies, he like took out his knife and skinned? <laughs> did you sleep? I did. Do it one more time. It only moves the time forward six hours, so it might still be too early. All right, I'll go. I'll go sleep again. I'm telling you, I'm sleeping. This I'm is going. just how the world works, baby. Maybe this place is just like Louisiana, where it's just always kind of, just like muddy. It definitely is like a swamp town. It yeah. definitely is, but you know there's like a sun in the world still. I don't know that. This looks like when I like have to like go catch a flight and I'm like chilling outside the airport at like a time that I don't even want to be conscious. See, there you go. Ah, it's daytime if I ever seen it. I don't know about that. This looks like what the weather is like right now in Los Angeles. Kind of. Yeah. There's the fucking gun man. The gun store's open, but not the fucking tailor, apparently. Did you kill the tailor? No, I can't kill the tailor. Are you sure you didn't shoot the tailor? Yes, I'm very sure right, I let's didn't see. kill the tailor. There is no tailor here. Are you Are sure? Are you the tailor? Dude, There's he just tailor. got to work. Yes, tailor. He just got to work. Okay, buy, all, buy the elegant suit scrap and the bollard gang scrap. Buy that one, and that one. And the treasure hunter scrap, why not? And that one. Yeah. And that one. That's just a bandana. That's tight. Anyway. Thank you. You want to sell him some skins? No. You're keeping those. Keeping those for. Keeping those keep, for a cold night. It, yeah, keeping it for a cold night. So we did it. Okay. Why is it still purple? Um. You hasn't, know. Hasn't uploaded yet. Oh, yeah, I have to use the item. I think. He cleans up well. Oh. Elegant suit menu. Entry. Did we just get the elegant suit? No, I think we just did another entry in it, but we also definitely just got the other suit. Yeah, what the fuck? Which is trying to show up. Well, the soon. purple went away. There yep, we go. We're now in we there. Have, now we have the Baller Twins outfit. We got a bunch of fucking clothes to put on. This game has a lot more outfits than LA Noir. And Alex is just, he just wants us to collect them all. Dude, open world games, millions of shit to do. I get a suit. Put on yeah, we got it. Yeah, look at that. There's the elegant suit. I'm digging it. We just look like, we look like a cop. We look like a cop. That's the sheriff's. That's the sheriff's clothes. This is the one we just got. Hey, oh, we look like we're in the That is the like gang. Yo, let me just like float this out there. This is the Bollard Twins outfit. Yeah. Tell me that doesn't just look like John Marston's fucking regular ass clothes. It's true. And now we have more outfits we don't know cuz we don't if have I was, them yet. If but I, hey, look at this. Oh boy. Prohibitionist. Savvy merchant. Whoa, buy or sell items at every gunsmith? That's tough. $200 worth of herbs. Now that's all I'm talking about. We... I know you guys can't see it, but Gerard just stopped playing the game and just turned and looked. He's smiling very calmly. Honestly, I'm still loving the Deadly Assassin suit the most. Yep, I'm right there with you. All right, so we've done a lot of nothing for the past three episodes. What the fuck are you talking about? We are gaining outfits, fabric in droves. Sure, Red Dead, 
redemption. Well, you know what? Here, fashion week. How about this? I would like to play Liars Dice. Liars Dice. Liars really? Dice. Is my one of my favorite real life games. Really? Yeah. I don't think I've ever played Liars Dice. I'll show you how it's played. Very easy. So Liars Dice is we are. Um, so you have to ante. We. Uh, let's ante. I'm in. Any up. Bid on the total number of dice on the table? Yeah, so I don't know how many dice we have, but we'll find out in a second. What do you mean you bid on the number of dice? To play Liars Dice, okay. It's been how many Take dice? A look at your dice face. How do I table? look at my die face? Is one. I don't know what this means. Wait, look at your dice. How RT? Yeah. Okay, so there's. We know, out of all of us right now, there's two fives. So here's what I'm gonna say. Wait, there how do we two, know that? Because I have two fives. So I'm gonna say. What? I don't understand. How do this. I? Oh, change. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Oh, is this like? I'm gonna say, there's two fives. Oh, this is like, uh, bullshit. The card yeah. game. Yeah. He says there's four fives. Okay. If the previous bid is low, a player can enter a new one. The new bid must have a higher face value. Coke Buckley says there's five ones? Yo, are you fucking kidding me? Five ones? I Get think the that's, fuck. that's I think bullshit. That's horseshit. Uh, there's no way that guy rolled five ones. I'm gonna call your bluff. Fuck you, dude. Fuck there's you. There's no way there's five no ones No one on gets day. five ones. You might as well just fucking killed yourself at that point. What's his name? Coke Buckley? Five ones. Show me your ones. No one had ones. I didn't have a one. The guy over there doesn't have a one, probably. You're telling me all your fucking dice are ones? You show no- Zero. 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 One. One. You're Got fucking him. dumb. Got him. This guy's dumb. What's his name? Coke Buckley. Yeah. He loses his die- He loses his die for bluffing, so now there's less die in play. Oh. What? Yeah. So now, there's one die out of the five. So Can there's you? now five. So Coke Buckley says there's at least one, two. Let's look at ours. Uh. Well. If he says there's one, two, then we know there's one, there's at least four. I'm going to say there's four twos. Yeah, that's truthful. So that's a good, truthful guess. Right. Four twos. My bad. Is he going to call bullshit on call you? Call bullshit. You're dumb. If one of you guys has a two, you're fucked. No, if he has a two, he's fucked. You're fucked. No, McSwain oh, doesn't have any. Two twos. Ooh. And five twos. At least four? It was true. There's at least fours. It you just has to be at got least? wrecked. Yeah. I said there were four twos. All right. He said, he I, said get no I mean, I get it. I just, I didn't understand that it had to be at least. He says there's one three. Okay, what do you have? Three twos. What do we got here? <sighs> Tell them there's four fives on the table. I will say... I can lower the... I'll say the three fives. Alright. Because I have two. Okay. Four threes? How many do you have? He calls oh, the Coke bluff. Coke calls it. Alright. Coke calls it! What do we got? No, no threes. threes. No threes. No threes. One, One three. three. Damn. You know what movie taught me this game? What? Pirates of the Caribbean, Pirates of the Caribbean 2. Dead Men's Chest. I don't remember that happening in that movie at all. There's a whole segment all about it. They completely teach you the rules of Liar's Dice in a movie? Yeah. No you one can actually buy the- I have this. The Pirates of the Caribbean Liar's Dice. I have it at my house. No wonder that movie is not well loved by most yeah. of the world. So how do I change- How- how long does it take to teach the- how- how long is this sequence? 15 minutes? How do I change my- my lower- I want to lower my bid. You can't lower your bid. Why you not? Can't, you can't go below four. That guy did though. No, you can go below on the number. Alright, I have at least- how many- how many fives? You have two fives. Do I think the other guy's gotta have- I'm gonna- this is a chance, I'm going on it. Four fives. Come on. Well, you, I mean, if he has two fives, you have four. It makes four. No fives. Ah, uh, oh, fuck, I'm short. Shit. So I lose a dice now. Oh. So now we're getting, now we're getting close to the wire, though, because uh, he's only got three dice. He's got four dice, and I have four dice. 
Enter the initial bid. Oh, I start. Okay, well, let's see. Look at your dice. I'm gonna say... Oh, dude, fucking there's say there's least... three ones. You think I should start out right away? Three ones? Say there's fucking four ones, then. I'll say there's three ones. I see your trickery. Perfect. Ah, Wit McSwain. Bye-bye, Mick McSwain. You ridiculously named... What do you call it? I've got three, and you've got none, bish. Get wrecked. He's getting just, he's getting too bold. He needs to chill or he's going to be left with no dice now, at all. Now, in this game, you can actually say the person's right. If there's exactly that amount... You can be like, yep, there is. There is, and then the person uh, wins. He said there's two ones? Two ones. I can declare the bid as spot on, but if there's more than one, then I lose. I don't know. I think maybe it might be spot on. Because they each, he said, I have one, and the other guy was like, yeah, I got one too. He could be bluffing, but like, I feel like if he bluffed, he would have buff, bluffed a little stronger. Maybe he said there's three ones. So you think I should call him out? Uh, yeah, fuck it. Or I can go two fours. But you only have one four. Right. I'm just trying to think numbers wise. Or I can go two threes. Well, how many how many dice are on the table right now? He's got four. Okay. He's got four. This guy's got one? He's got two. He's got two, and I've got four. So four, four. And two. It's only ten dice. Ten dice. I'm gonna say, just to be safe. He says two ones. I'm gonna say two threes. I'm gonna go that one of them has a three. All right. Think I'll make a bit. It's likely. It's possible. Three fours. Three fours. Calls the bluff. Coke calling the bluff. I got one. No fours. I have one four. And he has two. There's only two fours. Got him. Boom. Coke Getting just wrecked. knocking Whit McSwain out. No, dude. McSwain's got one die. He has one die. I know this is all boring to you guys, but I love this shit. I don't think it's boring, dude. I think Which it's tight. Which way two sixes? What? All right, what do you got? Oh, this is where it gets fun. I oh, have one shit. six. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, shit. This... Fuck it. Say there's four sixes. You think there's four sixes? Fuck it. Say it. Fuck it. Hey. I can't... Either... Okay, there's either four sixes or exactly three. Okay, declare it spot on. We haven't done it yet. Fuck All right, it. fine. I'm taking the chance. It's spot on. spot on. He's one got a six. six. He's got a six. One six. Yes. One six. I fucking Dude, knew it. What does that mean? He, the guy uh, who's. It's oh. a Swain gets. Oh, they both oh, lose a die. Shit. Okay. That was a huge so move. Now that was this a huge is where play we for win. You. This is where we win. We have four dice. He has three. Like he says there's one two. All right, do we have any twos? He has how many dice left? He has, he has three dice on three him? Three dice. Tell him there's two sixes. Oh, yeah, right. there are two sixes. You know what? Let's play it safe. Let's say there's one six. All right. All bid. All right. Let's see. See, he did that. Two twos. No, he didn't do it. He went up a number. He went up. Oh, so what he was did. his what was his first bid? One two, I believe, is what he put. One two, and then he said there's two twos, and I said there's one six, so he went to two twos. Tell him there's two sixes, and I have them. Yeah. Yeah. Then I then I'm gonna win no matter what at this point. I think there are two sixes. <laughs> Three. <laughs> okay. So you think this motherfucker's got this three? Motherfucker's got three twos. And that's it. That shit. Come out. I'm gonna call your fucking bluff, dude. No fucking call way. Call him out. Yeah. You got three twos. There's under no there? way. There's no, no way. fucking way. I have none. How many you have? One. One. You piece Get of wrecked. shit. Now it's your no. four versus. Is my four versus your two? What do you got? What do you got? Let's take it. You just gotta like not fuck up your math now, and you're good. Right. God's honest truth. One one. All right. What do you got? 
Tell him it's three fives. Why don't I make a bid? Don't believe me, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Get wrecked, Coke. What do you got, Coke? He had one one and one four, and I had three fives. Get wrecked, Coke. That's what I like to see. This is a dive for a valid bid. That's right, right. Biatch. Now it's my four, four to your one, dude. What do you got? Hmm. There's one four That's in here. Okay, shit. how many do we have? Tell him there's four. No, I'm gonna say Tell there's, him there's three. I'm gonna say there's three. You're right. Because what if he doesn't have a four? You're right. <laughs> I think there's three fours. That's his oh one bid. My intuition. Coke. <laughs> your own hubris took you out of the game, dude. Does he even have a four? Good. All right. At least he had a fucking four. Oh man. At least he had a fucking four. At least he had one. So what do we get for this? That's Sixty money. bucks. Not too bad. We we could have gotten more if we had bet more. Right. Up the ante. No. Or no. cash out. We're yeah, done. Cash out. We're good. I just want to show. It's one of my favorite games. It's a great game. It's a fun time. That's tight. I played this game uh, in high school and in college. Hello, I played this game all the time with friends in the dorms. What was your dorm game? Question of the day number five. I played Texas Hold'em all the time. It was Apples to Apples and Liar's Dice. Those are the two that uh, Frazier and I always played. I used to go on Wednesdays. I used to watch, uh, used to go bowling and then watch Lost. Well, Alex, it's been 30 minutes, my dude. We're done. Great. Done next time on episode. Beard Bros, we're going to go do a mission. Yeah. I think next time on Beard Bros, it's safe to say we're going to not do the flowers for the lady. We Let's could on our way. All right, we'll do that. Yeah. I'll set the side. Set a course. All, All right. right. Next Later, time on Beer Bros. Later, man. Bye.